the country of origin is is completely irrelevant to my shamanism. Although, having said that, when I studied shamanism academically, I wouldn't have got away with saying that. <laughs> yeah, in Mongolia, you've got Tengar, Dehil, and Tam. It goes on and on and on and on. There are applications of the three realms, or understanding of the three realms in a universal sense. They've got nothing to do with the, the mind, the body, or the spirit. What I think I'll do is I'll give you an example of how these realms can apply. They can apply in many, many different ways in life. I'll tell Dehil is the name of the Earth Mother, the spirit who in Mongol tradition and Siberian tradition is said to give the shaman his drum. The shaman doesn't travel to these three realms in the spirit journey. What the spirit journey does is stepping outside of these three realms. What in Japanese shamanism is known as the Tokoyu no Kuni, the Yonder Realm. The Woven Energy Podcast on iTunes now.